What is LEED V5? The LEED V5 rating system is the latest version of the LEED Green Building Certification Program. The rating system addresses crucial issues such as equity, health, ecosystems, and resilience. This version of LEED is the result of deep and meaningful conversations with the LEED community and is fueled by an urgency to address the most pressing global concerns. It is a representation of what we have heard from volunteers, members, stakeholders, and many others about the needs driving business decisions across the built environment. LEED V5 is built around a restructured LEED rating system framework, at the top of which are the system goals, climate action, quality of life, and ecological conservation and restoration. These are the overarching areas of focus that will guide the next several versions of the rating system and will also serve as the mechanism for prioritizing the way project teams are rewarded for pursuing various strategies. Diving a level deeper, the future of LEED principles identify a granular list of what LEED can and must achieve through LEED V5 and the versions that follow and include. Decarbonize the building industry swiftly to reflect the urgency of the climate crisis. Inspire and recognize adaptive and resilient built environments. Invest in human health and well-being. Create environments in which diversity, equity, and inclusivity thrive. Support flourishing ecosystems through regenerative development practices. What's new in LEED V5? Here are some examples of new and notable elements from the recently released LEED V5 for operations and maintenance draft, as well as the highly anticipated LEED V5 building design and construction rating system, which is currently under development. Most significant sources of carbon emissions in buildings include operational, embodied and transportation emissions. Operational carbon emissions from energy used to operate buildings and from refrigerant containing equipment. Embodied carbon emissions from materials used in the construction and renovation of buildings, as well as waste generated throughout building construction, operation, and renovation. Transportation carbon emissions from transportation to and from the building. All LEED V5 rating systems will enhance the carbon literacy of the industry. The operations and maintenance rating system rewards existing buildings for leadership and planning to hit future decarbonization targets for buildings with ultra-low carbon emissions. The building design and construction rating system provides clear steps for delivering new buildings with ultra-low greenhouse gas emissions. LEED V5 facilitates the creation and maintenance of safe and healthy spaces that promote physical, mental and behavioral well-being for all occupants in current and future climates. Operations and maintenance includes a credit for continual assessment and verification of measurable indoor air quality, which also rewards projects for having strategies in place that address air quality management modes for infection risk, wildfires, and other extreme shifts in air quality. Building design and construction is being developed to promote proactive evaluation of, and preparation for, the changing climate and the risks posed by shocks and stressors. Credits are anticipated to promote resilience strategies in site design, envelope and infrastructure design, and ventilation system design. LEED V5 recognizes that readiness and adaptation are critical and rewards operational preparedness for extreme events. Operations and maintenance helps projects understand who is in the building and meets occupant needs with a health-centric approach, including identifying health resilience goals. The system requires all projects to conduct an assessment for climate resilience and rewards proactive establishment of a plan for responding to present and potential future hazards that could affect the project site and or building function. LEED V5 asks teams to understand and address the social impact of a project. Operations and maintenance focuses on equity within cleaning operations and protections for cleaning personnel. It encourages equity, access and economic empowerment by rewarding the development of renewable energy projects that directly support underserved and frontline communities, including the transfer of energy rights ownership to the community. The building design and construction rating system is being developed to encourage equitable development practices through community engagement, to foster greater equity within construction practices, and to promote equitable access to green buildings and the resources they provide. The first LEED V5 release is focused on existing buildings and designed to deliver an understandable, actionable, and transformational rating system with a clear roadmap for progressive actions that facilitate LEED certification. The draft provides industry benchmarking and maintains a measured, data-driven approach to certification while also guiding projects toward optimized performance through clearly identified strategies. 
this will assist lead users in anticipating and preparing for several years of building operations, encompassing legislative mandates, impending climate risks and expected industry trends. On September 28, the USGBC introduced a draft of its LEED V5 Operations and Maintenance Rating System for existing buildings. The LEED Rating System is the world's preeminent green building certification system, with more than 100,000 projects certified globally. While the launch of LEED V5 begins with existing buildings, LEED V5 for building design and construction will roll out in 2024. The White House has announced a plan to create a new national definition of zero emissions building. LEED V5 will align with this definition, including requirements for LEED zero carbon and platinum level projects that specify low to no operational GHG emissions to help the industry coalesce impactful strategies. The move aims to empower and engage the market towards zero emission buildings and will be referenced in federal programs and state and local policies. USGBC and other organizations in the green building space will align around this national definition to send a clear market signal. Buildings are responsible for around 40% of global energy-related carbon emissions, with 28% stemming from operational emissions, which include energy needed to heat, cool and power them. The LEED V5 Operations and Maintenance Draft is designed to deliver an understandable, actionable and transformational rating system with a clear roadmap for progressive actions that facilitate LEED certification. The draft offers industry benchmarking and scoring to reward performance while maintaining a measured data-driven approach to certification. This will assist LEED users in anticipating and preparing for several years of building operations, encompassing legislative mandates, impending climate risks and expected industry trends. As part of the launch, a beta version of the LEED V5 Operations and Maintenance Rating System will open with a select group of project teams across a diverse range of projects. The projects will provide critical feedback that will play a crucial role in refining the language and functionality of the system. The beta phase will commence in the fourth quarter of 2023. For more information on LEED V5, we encourage design professionals and building product manufacturers to visit the USGBC website. In addition, design professionals that need their mandatory LEED education can find free courses at Green CE, building product manufacturers that need help creating LEED courses, LEED webinars, health product declarations, declare labels, and environmental product declarations to get their products specified, can also find helpful resources here. Thank you and have a wonderful day.